There's a moose swinging in the bay, in the harbor. Hey, crazy. All right, it's back to work. Now that the wedding's done, we have to build living quarters back in that corner, some bunk beds, a little kitchenette, a bathroom. We gotta put up the kiln wall. We gotta put up the tool wall. Pop's here to help me until the 29th. Yeah. So it's time to get our shop back. Yeah. Bring the shop back, make the shop great again. Got the kiln chamber walls up. Right now it's kind of our kitchen slash dining room. This section here, this little hallway, this is the uh, tool corral. So all the tools are gonna be here. We're gonna finish the joists. That's all gonna be loft storage up above there. And then we're gonna do a little bedroom back here with a shower, toilet, washer, dryer, and the kitchen sink is gonna go back here. So that's almost there. And of course our main shop space. So up above those beams is the loft storage. No more wedding venue. It's work time. Well, we had a nice cottonwood log that yielded quite a bit. We're walking through the kiln chamber, future kiln chamber. So the shop space slowly coming together. This is gonna be our tool corral. All the workbenches are gonna line this wall. All the tools are gonna to get hung up. So that's kind of starting to take shape. Got a lot done today. Pop, it's gonna be a neat little shop. What did happen? Probably something I think. Ah yes. Water. Water. Oh, that's a nice shower head. Yeah. You know where that one's from? Yes, but we dare not utter that name. Matt's over there running. What are you doing, Matt? Uh, running our mechanical ducting for our dryer vent. Dryer vent. Yep. So this was where the wedding happened. Now it's full-blown shop. Let me turn around and show you. Plugging away. This is what we've been up to the last few days. Getting stuff situated. Getting our tool corral getting our lighting in, working on uh, a cabinet for where the fridge and the little oven are gonna go. That's the start of that cabinet. So yeah, we've been pretty busy last few days. Oh wait, there's more. Oh, look at that. Mood lighting. Nice productive day today. Got um, some more stuff brought in, slowly organizing. Still not quite there, but we'll get there. Our tool corral is almost done. Got the cabinet up, gotta make a face frame and some doors for that. Just all scrap material left over from the sawmill. But uh, all our tools are here. Supplies and more tools and fasteners and all that kind of stuff there. Uh, loft storage up top, that's where I'm going to throw all the adventure gear, ski gear, climbing gear. And we've got the outside. 
carport or sawmill port. This is where we're gonna be milling in inclement weather. So we've got a nice covered area to keep plugging away on, keep us dry, keep us working. Got a bunch of these leftover ends from milling from the good logs. And today's project is I am going to make two bunk beds from these rounds. I've never done that before, so we'll see how that goes. So it's been a minute, but little update. This is our kiln chamber, currently being used as some storage, but uh, slowly starting to finish stuff out on the inside of the shop. A little tour, real quick. We finished our little kitchenette. Gotta put that door in, into the kiln. But, uh oh, stepped on something. But got the cabinets in, got to make some face frames and some doors, get all that situated, little little pantry. That door is going to also get installed. Got a sink, washer dryer, toilet, shower, and then the little living quarters. Put together a quick bump bed from some scrap that we had. That sort of little coffee cabinet, coffee and tea. Also need to make some cabinet doors for that and face frame. And then the shop is pretty much almost dialed in, almost dialed in. We're still kind of organizing nuts and bolts, got to go through and make things easily accessible. That's our home theater for the, for the moment. using this space to entertain before we get the timbers and start working in here. So really like the tool corral behind here. Everything's here. Good working experience when you know that all your tools are where they need to be. So I don't know. Just a few more weeks, we'll get stuff buttoned up in here and then go back to timbers. It's raining outside, well, snowing. It's raining outside. And I wanna make some kebabs. So I have to make a jig to hold the skewers um, in there. Let's see if we can make some kebab. All right, my contraption worked. Gonna have kebabs and don't have to be out in the rain. Wood stove to the rescue.